Good morning, everyone. Welcome back into North Dakota today. Well, Veterans Honor Flight of North Dakota, Minnesota is a nonprofit organization created solely to honor America's veterans for all their sacrifices. Vice President Lori Eshog stops by the studio to talk about dates for upcoming flights. Good morning, Lori. Well, good morning. Thanks for having us. Yes, thank you for coming back. We love having you in studio. Well, thank you. Yes. All right, so let's jump right in. Are you ready to announce the dates of the upcoming flights for 2025? Yes, we are. We're um the board and all of us are excited for next year. Mm -hmm. We basically have five flights going out. Yeah. So um, the first one is uh, April 20th through the 22nd out of Grand Forks. Um, we're going to take two planes on that flight. Mm -hmm. So they'll leave an hour apart from each other. And then a couple weeks after that flight, um, May 4th through the 6th, mm -hmm. I got to use my cheat notes. I don't yep. know those dates by heart <laughs> yet. Uh, May 4th through the 6th, we'll be going out of Fargo, mm -hmm. and that'll be one plane. And then in the fall, we're going to do two planes again out of Fargo, September 28th through the 30th. Wow. Yeah. So it's just exciting. Our list is almost up to 900. Mm -hmm. So we, um, we want to get our list down. Yes. So we're actively fundraising for those flights. So yeah, we're excited. Just how important is that fundraising? I mean, we all know this is truly such a noble cause. And how important is it that folks in our community really give back by donating? Well, it's very important because that is actually what funds the flights. Yep. You know, is the donations through private, you know, people, um, through our fundraising efforts, through mm -hmm. the service clubs. It all goes to the flight. Yep. You know, that's our ultimate goal is to get our veterans to D.C. Mm -hmm. So we're constantly fundraising. It's, um, it's a love. So we totally enjoy it. Yes, absolutely. I also understand that there's a big fundraiser coming up this summer. Can you fill us in? Yeah. It's going to be July 26th through the 27th mm -hmm. at the American Legion in Moorhead. So it's called Summer Blast. It's going to be a two-day music fest. Ooh. Yeah, so... Um, I'll just kind of tell you the bands because that's really exciting. So Friday we'll start out with, um, it's part of the Red River Veterans Concert Band. It's their Dixieland band. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to go into um, Ruckus. It's a local band here in town. Yeah. And after that, we'll wrap up Friday night with the ACDC Tribute Band. Ooh, yeah. fun. Okay. So, and then on Saturday, there'll be games all day for kids. It's mm -hmm. a family affair. Um, we'll start with Rick Adams from about 3 to 5, and then we'll go into Slamabama. Fun. They're going to do their Shania Twain, um, Taylor Swift uh, stuff. Okay, we and love that. And then we're going to end up with the Queen Tribute Band. Fun. So, yeah, so we've been working really hard on that event, mm -hmm. and um, we thought, well, how are we going to get these tickets, you know, to kind of celebrate it? So what we're going to do mm -hmm. is on April 28th in a couple weeks, we um, have a potato dumpling feed at the Legion, and that's actually for the honor flight. Mm -hmm. uh, the, the manager of the Legion, Scott Moe, and his family graciously does this fundraiser for the last three years. Uh, we end up peeling over 500 pounds of potatoes. Oh, my goodness. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> so we decided that what better way to kick off the ticket sales yep. than to be at the Legion in Moorhead that day. So about 1 o'clock, we're mm -hmm. going to uh, kick it off. And um, Slam Obama is going to come and join the fun. Fun. Yeah. Well, this is all so exciting. I mean, I truly can't think of a more worthy cause. It really is. It, um, it makes you feel good knowing that you're helping them because in reality, they helped us. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. It's truly so important. You know, I would really urge anyone to donate. I know that we have been very heavily involved, involved yes, yes. here at Valley News Live. So thank you so much for being here, Lori. Well, thank you so much for having us. Yes, of course. Okay. Well, we have had such a jam-packed show this morning that we are ending it right here. Thank you so much for joining us this morning, and we will see you right back here on the North Dakota Today couch tomorrow.